this is going to be a very short video explaining a little bit about the watch me feature and the follow me feature on the unique Q500 series uh, multi-copter. So real quickly, um, those of you who have sent the question and asked me uh, what do I do about my uh, transmitter that does not have this display, they have, they have it without the actual camera settings so you can't turn up um, the ISOs and so forth and you don't have the settings. It's very, very simple. Just go to flight settings and then you'll see camera select. When you hit camera select, you'll see the Seago Pro eliminate underneath this piece of tape. It says Seago Pro, Seago 3 Pro. Select that. If you have any of these other cameras selected, uh, you won't have that feature. But once you hit that, setup is complete. Go back to your main screen and you'll have this, this option here. So that's why you don't have it. It's just a, a a selection on your transmitter so uh, let's get this up in the air and what I'm gonna be talking about is this little icon here in the corner you see that little thing that I checked on there green red we're gonna be talking about that that's what turns on your watch me mode on and off when it's red it the watch me mode is off and when it's green the watch me mode is on the follow me and watch me features do not work unless you are in the smart mode which is selected by your transmitter up here this is your smart and your angle and then your return to home so let me get the uh, bird in the air and we'll talk a little bit about those two different modes follow me and watch me okay very quickly we're just going to talk about the follow me mode right now I have the drone hovering in front of me uh, we have the bird up in the air about 31 feet and about 40 feet away from me and you're going to notice that as I walk, let me focus more on that bird. Uh, I guess that's not going to work. Okay, so as we walk, in the follow me mode, the drone moves in relation to wherever I'm walking. It's going to follow me. The camera is not doing anything different. It's just the drone. It's going to keep the same distance away from me and the same height in relation to wherever I'm moving. Now, what makes this watch me mode different is once I select the watch me mode, this drone will now focus the camera directly on me. I want you to watch the display as I select the watch me mode. So here's the watch me mode. I'm going to press the button. And now the, cam the bird has turned itself directly at me. and it's focused directly on me, now wherever I decide to walk, it will always stay focused on me. If I decide to run around in circles, it'll always keep that camera focused on me, no matter where I go or no matter what I'm doing. I know it's very difficult to see that at night, but unfortunately I had to work with what time I have available. So, watch me mode, it watches you. The other thing that's interesting is no matter what you're doing with the sticks, for example, watch the display. The drone is going all over the place. But the camera stays focused on me. No matter what you're doing with the drone, it will always stay focused on you no matter what you're doing with the sticks. The stick on the left, if you're wondering, does nothing when you're in the watch me mode. It will not change the rotation of the craft because it wants to stay focused on you and not get the landing gears uh, in the shot. Now that won't be the case if you turn this off and you go into the follow me mode. Now we're in the follow me mode and you'll notice by me touching the stick on the left it will now change the rotation of the craft and of course change the camera angle. Now if I decide to, let's just rotate the craft 
Uh, it's terrible to do this at night, but in the daytime it's so bright it's really hard to see. Now, if I push the watch me mode, watch how it brings it back into, whoops, hard to see through the screen here. It automatically brings it back into focus and it puts the camera right back on the action. So hopefully that explains a little bit about the watch me, follow me mode. Very simply put, once you're in the smart mode with this selector here, push the green button and that camera will stay focused on you at all times, no matter what you're doing with the drone. In follow me mode, it will only keep the same distance and altitude from the transmitter in relation to what you're doing and where you're walking. Thanks for watching.